per minute insane cuts this is a second video because in the first video we just did some extreme cuts and we went from a hundred thousand to 125 to 150 175 200 thousands deep at a radio of 2.7 which created an MRR of 540 cubic inches of material being removed, boom! And at the end of that video, we said, we're gonna actually come back, we're gonna turn on the Synergy 735, we're gonna bring it through that spindle, and we're gonna take a bigger cut with the coolant and show that by running coolant, you can take some insane cuts, and the lubricity is everything. Not only that, but we're gonna show you guys the tool after the cut, we're gonna compare the performance and the sound of the cut that we did dry compared to the one we did with coolant, and we're gonna show you guys the chips from the cut like you guys were asking for in the comments, so stay tuned for that. Today, we're going bigger. Our axial is 0.23, our radial is not 2.7, now it's 2.8. We're still at a thousand inches per minute and that puts us at a MRR of 644 cubic inches per minute. Ooh. This is the 5720 shell mill from Kenna Metal, and we're about to feed this bad boy. Boom, 104 MRR higher than the cut that we just did. Is it gonna do it? I don't know, man. This is a huge cut, and I was scared before. Boom. Barry, yo. Get ready to stop it now. Man, I'm ready. Get ready to stop it, Barry. Y'all ready to go? That was very anti -clown. You didn't. Yeah. Put, you didn't put the 230 in. I did. What? Oh, on the radius. Dude, you said you didn't. <laughs> I did. I, Dude. I'm not perfect all the time. Just. Oh, I'm under pressure now. Under pressure. <laughs> you heard me look at him. You double checked it. You all double checked right. everything. You dry ran it. All of it, right? Yep. You're good. Yep, we're good. Okay. Yes, yes, well, yes, yes. I ran it above. That's the problem. <laughs> we're gonna go one tenth deep. This is gonna be epic. All right, you wanna try that again? This is too insane. Oh, 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 oh. oh man! Dude! 644 cubic inches per minute. Oh! I can't wait to look at the tool. Sounded amazing. Dude, you heard the difference between those two cuts, right? When we were dry, it sounded like the apocalypse. And then when we came in with coolant, it sounded nice. You guys gotta understand, we don't just run tools. We calculate the horsepower, and we talk to Kessler spindles to figure out exactly what that spindle could handle. Talk to Ebarmia. So everything is strategy. Everything has been calculated, and that, my friends, was right on the upper end. Yeah, bro, but I really wanna see those chips, and I know you guys do too. Check this out. Ooh, oh, man. Looks like Snoop Dogg been in here. <laughs> Oh man, what do I have here but a pair of Mitchell Toyo calipers? So, very, those are some thick chips yeah, right there. For an aluminum face oh, mill? Oh man! It should be about 25 thou. 26 five. 26 thousandths, five tenths. Ooh, that's a big chip there. You guys wanted to see the chips? Here they are. All right, check it out. Bring the camera over here. Check out these inserts right there. Beautiful. There's no buildup. The tool is absolutely 
perfect. The tool handle it, no problem. This tool is available in our online store, so make sure you check out the link in the description. And then you bring in that Synergy 735 right through that spindle. That lubrication is everything. And you know what's crazy too? Is that these are finishing inserts. They're finishing inserts. And the radius, what size is the radius? Uh, 30 thou. Yeah, 30 thousandths radius with a special hone for finishing. And Kenna Metal has these roughing inserts with big old radiuses. But I was like, we're having so much success. We're not changing anything. Thing. Let's go with the exact same insert. Boom, CNC machining. Go ahead, get your blood flowing. Woo, love it. All right, so I hope you guys liked today's video. Please ring the bell and subscribe so you'll be notified when we upload our next video. Be sure to leave down in the comments what you guys would like to see us do next time, and your idea may just be our next video. Catch you guys again next time. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That's a big step. Big picture.